It goes without debate. Huntersville is a busy place. So how do we deal with that and plan for the future? Candidates for mayor and commissioner tackled that in a recent forum hosted by the Lake Norman Chamber and WSIC. I would start with regionalism. Uh, we have, we're effectively dead in the water. We're not speaking with CMS. We're not speaking with a county. We have uh, isolated ourselves from the state, our local state legislators. Former Huntersville Commissioner Rob Kidwell is challenging incumbent Mayor John Anarella, who says the town is working with its partners already. I think one of the things that I would definitely consider, uh, continue to do is accelerate the infrastructure projects. Um, we have partnered very successfully with the state and the county to build Patterson Road, which is now going to bring about $100 million worth of commercial business to the town. Kidwell says success now is thanks to work of those who have served before. Huntersville has um, great potential, and we've done a lot of good things over the years, and that's because of past boards. And lately, it's just kind of slowed down, so it's time to get it back up and running. How to manage future development was a key topic for commissioner candidates as well. Realize that we're growing at a rate that's tremendous. Within 15 years, they say we're going to be at 100,000 people. We have to get ready with our infrastructure that has been lagging behind today. As we continue to build, I hear a lot of negativity from the community that we need to slow down. Stacey Phillips and other candidates say it's important to encourage business growth, have the needed infrastructure, and not forget about green space. I think it's critical to do these things. We have to plan around uh, infrastructure as well. We're not going to grow as a town if we only build homes. We need to bring in businesses, unique businesses, so that we're thriving and we're different than Cornelius. We're in competition with Concord, Cornelius Davidson, so we need to keep Huntersville unique. You can watch the forum in its entirety at WSICFM.com. I'm Chris Hoke, WSIC News.